Persona 3, Dancing in Moonlight. Oh, hey there. Sorry, I still don't really get what's going on here. This is a dream, right? In reality, we're all asleep in our beds, which means we're all having the same dream? And we don't have to worry about time, right? We'll forget everything when we wake up? Well, no sense in overthinking it. I'll go with the flow. It's scary how used to this I am. Somehow, it just feels like another day to me. A few years ago, I would have been freaking out. I adjust to things way too fast. Dancing, though? That really came out of nowhere. Nope, but nothing ventured, nothing gained, right? Oh, but I think I can picture myself doing it. I like music and I watch dance videos. What else? Uh, cheerleading? I kind of used to think that was cool. But I turned down the cheerleading club when they asked me to join. I was too embarrassed. What about you? Ever tear up the dance floor anywhere? Like at Club Escapade? <laughs> well, now I don't feel so bad. All right, let's do our best. Uh, I used to be interested in dancing, so... What, really? Whoa, no way. Well, I guess that'll come in handy here, huh? Uh, I used to be interested in dancing, so this seems like a good chance to try it out. Honestly, I still think this is crazy, but then again, I can dance my heart out here. I'll be counting on you if something happens, okay? You seem like you can handle anything. All right, I think I'll go practice. It's our job to hype up the crowd, right? Okay, time to dance. I'm gonna be the disco queen. Huh? Is that not right? You're here to practice, too? Whew, that was a good workout. I'm gonna take a little break. <laughs> Being together like this, it's almost like we're back in the dorm. This dream rocks. I don't have to go to class, and my room is the same as it is in reality. Oh, you mean our waiting rooms? Yeah, I was surprised. It looks just like my actual room. It even has all the same things in it. How does that work? Like, I wanted to listen to a CD, but it wasn't in its case here, either. Hmm. Wait. Uh, what's up, Yucatan? I just realized that I let you borrow that CD, Junpei. Uh-oh. You remembered that, huh? <sighs> Unbelievable. Give it back already. Yeah, uh, wait, please. Just let me hold on to it for a little longer. Actually, uh, can I borrow a few more? Are you kidding me? How about you give back what you've already got first? Wait, hmm. This is a dream, right? Yeah, LP said we'd forget everything when we woke up. Oh, that's right, lucky me! I mean, uh, wow, that's too bad, huh? All right, just forget Stu Pay for now. Oh, nice one, dude! Oh, that's too bad. Nothing we can do about it, huh? <laughs> oh, you little... Well, I guess this is a dream, so we'll forget everything when we wake up. All right, just forget Stu Pay for now. Hey, you're always wearing earphones, huh? What kind of stuff do you listen to? Oh, you mean like heavy metal? That's not at all what I imagined. For me, it's gotta be rock. And maybe... 
Oh, like classical? I can sort of picture that. For me, it's gotta be rock. And maybe... <laughs> you don't have to hide it. What is it, country or something? For me, it's gotta be rock. And maybe a little pop. I'm a pretty good singer myself, you know? Don't believe me? <laughs> Wait till I'm on stage. Uh, don't know, don't wanna know. Ah, come on! At least listen! Music sure is interesting, though. Just listening to it is enough to fire someone up or make them cry. It can even make you remember the past, if you listen to a song from that time. Right? Memories just come flooding back. Yeah, I was so young and foolish. No, memories just come flooding back to me. Yeah, I was so young and foolish back in the day. Not that you really learned anything. Ah, uh, lay off! I worked hard to get where I am. The music we listened to this year, it's definitely linked to our memories. Maybe we'll end up remembering this place after all. So we have to do our best. I don't want my memories of this place to be embarrassing. Okay, I mean, we won't get a chance like this again, right? <laughs> Guess I shouldn't bite off more than I can chew. I'll just go at my own pace. <laughs> Honestly, that may be the way to go. You don't get results by pushing too hard. I'm raring to go too. This is gonna be the best night ever. We're gonna forget everything anyway, so we don't have to worry about Junpei messing up. I do wish I could remember seeing everyone on stage though. Wait, why am I the only one getting singled out here? What's up? Fuka and I were just practicing together. We were doing pretty good, weren't we, Fuka? Yeah, that went really well. You're getting good, Yukari-chan. Then again, I'm not very athletic. You're so fast that I can hardly keep up. <laughs> Thanks. I feel more confident hearing that from you. Well, I don't really have a feel for it, but I am. You're seriously exaggerating. But I guess that means you're counting on me, huh? Well, I don't really have a feel for it, but I am. Is this the time to be competing? I mean, you're right, though. Well, I don't really have a feel for it, but I am in a sports club. So I'm not opposed to exercising. Well, you are a member of the archery club, Yukari-chan. I'm technically their star athlete after all. I can't be slacking off now. <laughs> Did you only just remember? Well, archery is pretty forgettable. Really? I think it's cool the way archers dance. What? But I use my bow in battle all the time. Well, I guess I can't blame you. Archery is pretty forgettable. Really? I think it's cool the way archers stand in place and take aim. Well, sticking with archery turned out to be beneficial for fighting shadows, right? You never know what'll end up being useful in life. You think all this dancing will be good for something? I wonder. But thinking that way does make me want to try harder. Isn't it good to go all out in everything you do? I'm sure someone's watching over us. <laughs> you sound like a sage, Yukari-chan. Oh no, do I sound like an old lady? 
I mean, with all that's happened recently, we've kind of reached enlightenment. I know, right? Soon I'll be going to the convenience store in my pajamas. <laughs> that doesn't have anything to do with enlightenment. Huh, you don't think so? Uh, excuse me? <laughs> you two get along so well. Huh, you think so? Timing. I was just talking with LP. I have tons of questions to ask. So you're the one who chose the locations of our stages, right, LP? Exactly. That's right, that's right. No time to waste. I select the location with my superb taste. I add some oof to the design like a mage, and the result you see is a fine dance stage. Okay. I don't know why you're talking like that, but wow. It's all so familiar, both the town and the scenery during the dark hour. Hey, I've been wondering for a while now, how do you and LP know each other? A guest? I don't really get what you're saying. You mean like a customer at a shop or something? Must be one fancy place. I have merely supported him from the shadows on his journey. You could say that my role is to aid our guests along their chosen paths. Or perhaps I should call it an unrequited love. In spite of my best efforts, I'm doomed to serve in the capacity of a supporting character. You're saying that about yourself? Still, you sure are popular. In any case, I wanted to thank you for taking you. Gorgeous! I am truly honored! I was certain that I was nothing more than an insignificant pebble beneath your heel. What? How does he usually treat you? In any case, I wanted to thank you for taking you. Oh, I see. LP is really pretty. What you mean by hit it off, but I hit quite hard in a fist fight. Whoa, things got scary there all of a sudden. In any case, I wanted to thank you for taking care of our leader. Hmm? I'm not aware of having done anything that would warrant thanks. Well, you've been helping him, and that in turn helps us. Maybe you weren't doing it directly, but I still wanted to thank you all the same. I see. So that was what you meant. I am grateful for your concern. I should have expected no less from those bonded so tightly. <laughs> Thanks. It's kind of embarrassing to hear it so directly. Yeah, I'm glad we're all together. I hope we stay that way. Why do you say that like it's nothing? Don't act out of character because it's a dream. In any case, Yukari, I require no thanks. We attendants are fascinated with our guests as they embark upon their journeys. There is no greater pleasure than to watch over them until they reach their destinations. Mm, I don't really understand. Is that how you see it? Likewise, I am also observing you and the path you are taking, Yukari. What? Me too? Why, yes. After you were thrust into battle, you seemed quite lost on how to press on. But seeing you conquer your weaknesses and overcome your hardships was quite inspiring. I do not speak in hyperbole when I say you may have grown the most of all. You're kidding. How do you know so much about me? 
I mean, have I really changed that much? Really? Hmm, I didn't notice. <laughs> now, as much as Yukari has grown mentally… Yeah, of course not. Then again, I probably wouldn't notice a change in you either. Now, as much as Yukari has grown mentally, so has she physically as well. If I may draw particular attention to the increase in size of her chest area… Hey! Just where are you steering this conversation to? You don't need to know! All right, this discussion is over. <gasps> That's rude, you know. All right, this discussion is over. Wouldn't it mess up the middle part if we did that? We need to turn smoother. We also fell out of sync on the last part. We need to focus on maintaining our rhythm. You're right. Let's take a short break and then give that a try. Hey, what's up? Mitsuru-senpai and I are practicing together. <laughs> Senpai and I were just talking. If we're going to do this, we want to do it right. I'm thankful to have someone who can give me an honest... <laughs> Is that how we looked? We were getting pretty serious just now. I'm thankful to have someone who can give me an honest opinion. <laughs> I'd never hold back from you. We're best friends after all. <laughs> I know. I hope you'll continue to be patient with me, Yukari. Well, that's kind of a secret. Right, Mitsuru-senpai? Right. That was a much-needed and painful reminder. But it's not just us. We've all been getting along, surprisingly. Well, a lot has happened, that's for sure. Everyone's amazing. No matter who's on stage, they always dance well together. I started thinking again that maybe our hearts are all connected or something. You don't feel it? Well, there's no better time to close that gap. We won't have another chance like this. Of course, you're the one who brought us all together. Yes, it's only due to having a strong leader that we have such a tight bond. That said, keep up the good work. We're all counting on you. All right, let's use the power of friendship to really hype up that crowd. My, I never thought the day would come when I'd hear you say that. Oh, uh, maybe I got it from Akihiko-senpai or Junpei. Thank you for the invitation, Yukari-san. It's good to kick back and hang out every now and then. Make yourselves at home. So this is Yukari-san's room. As I expected, it is different from mine. <laughs> you think so? All I did was put up a bunch of stuff I liked. Oh, should I make some tea? Yeah, I know. I really need to clean this place up. Oh, should I make some tea? Huh? True. The atmospheric composition of this room is different from mine. It smells very nice. Is it some type of aromatic? Oh, oh that's what you mean. For a second there, I had the wrong idea about you. Oh, should I make some tea? Since I've got company, I can use the good stuff I got from Mitsuru-senpai. I will assist you, or I would. But this is a dream, Yukari-san. Oh, that's right. Old habit, sorry. So now what? Suddenly there's nothing to do. 
Really? Well, okay. But don't go making a mess just because we have some free time. Still, I am curious about what... Huh? Um, no, nothing to see here. And stop staring. I mean it. Still, I am curious about what you keep here in your room. Bags, shoes, cosmetics. My room does not contain any of these items. <laughs> yeah, those things are really starting to pile up. Admirable as always, Yukari-san. I think you are the definition of the word stylish. But why are you so interested in it? Are you trying to get someone's attention? Hmm, if I had to say, I think it's because it's so much fun. I love cute things. And as for clothes, I just wear what I like. Dressing all cute kind of changes my mood. It helps me see the world differently. The world? How intriguing. <laughs> well, I may have been exaggerating a bit. But don't you feel like a different person when you switch outfits when you're dancing? That's what I mean. It's the easiest way to change who I am. I believe I understand. It can be pretty hard on my wallet, though. But there are bargains, too. Finding those is its own kind of fun. Hey, do you want to come with me next time, I guess? We can find something cute for you. Really? Are there clothes that would look cute on me? Yeah, there's all kinds of stuff. And I know a lot of shops. All right then, you're coming with us. So... Yeah, you just gotta go and see what they have. And I know a lot of shops. All right then, you're coming with us. So... <laughs> Looks like our leader wants to join us. He may actually have a better idea than anyone. All right then, you're coming with us. Someone's gotta carry all the bags, right? I see. That is reassuring. Now we can shop at maximum capacity. Then it's settled! We should start thinking about items to put together for your outfit. Let's all go to Fuka's room and discuss. Understood. No real reason for inviting you here. I just wanted to chat a bit. So, how long do you think this dream will last? Honestly, I'm really enjoying myself here. So much so that I kind of don't want it to end. <laughs> you too? Well, I'm glad I'm not the only one. At first, I wasn't sure I could do this, but no. <laughs> yeah. I know, I'm weird. I'm aware it's a dream, but here I am, wishing I didn't have to wake up from it. At first, I wasn't sure I could do this, but now I'm really into it. I think I've become a pretty good dancer, too. What do you think? Yes, I knew it! I feel like my dance moves are close to what I envision them to be. It's crazy, though, thinking in your head that you can... What? Still not good enough? Well, I guess you know how much potential I have, huh? It's crazy, though, thinking in your head that you can... Is this really the time to be competing? Okay, let's see how long you can say that. It's crazy, though, thinking in your head that you can do it enables you to pull it off. I guess it's because this is a dream. If only reality worked the same way. You're right, I know. That's what we have to do. Even in reality, we have to see ourselves... No, it's not that. I'm ready for whatever happens. Even in reality, we have to see ourselves succeeding, then work to make it happen. And we know the importance of believing in ourselves better than anyone. 
Whoa, <laughs> things turned really serious there. Sorry about that. I told myself I wouldn't think about that stuff while we're here. Of course, there's still a long... Yeah, I'm glad to hear you say that. I hope I'm getting better at keeping up. Of course, there's still a long way to go. But I know that a day will come when we can all laugh and have fun together. Before, I would have been crying, scared of the unknown. But it looks like I'm making some progress. I'm going to keep at it so I can help everyone. Oh no! I forgot I was supposed to practice with Fuka! out there just now. You know, you've reached a pretty high level. <laughs> you might even be able to go pro. Do you want to be a celebrity or something? <laughs> I didn't think so. You seem more like the behind-the-scenes kind of guy than the guy in the spotlight. Okay, on a more serious note, I should... Whoa, really? Wow, I had no idea. I can't really picture it. Okay, on a more serious note, I should... Wait, are you joking? You look so serious, I can't tell. But I can believe it. After all, we never would have gotten this far without you. Okay, on a more serious note, I should really think about the future. Nothing major right now, though. Just stuff like, it'd be cool to do stuff I like for work. <laughs> yeah, I guess. But even that's really vague. Still, I think I've started to notice a new me. <laughs> oh, me? I've never thought about that. Well, I didn't have a lot of fun here. Maybe I could. Ugh, I sound as naive as Junpei. Just forget it. Still, I think I've started to notice a new me from all this dancing. When I'm with you, I feel like a side of me I never knew existed comes out. I guess you bring out my potential. Or maybe I'm just being dramatic. <laughs> this is a dream, right? Well, before we wake up and forget everything, I just wanted to say thanks. So, thank you, leader. I'm glad to be a part of the team. Hey, once this is all over, I really want to have a party to celebrate. A nice, fancy one, with Mitsuru-senpai's financial assistance, maybe? Oh no, not again! I'm supposed to be practicing with Mitsuru-senpai right now! Sorry, I gotta go!